I've started to think that, well, it's not important for now, but Edward, did you sew it? Have you, have you maybe noticed his eyes? Those, those damn eyes. It felt at first like a good idea, a bit like vodka, fresh at first, but then it burns, and I felt loved, but with such hate. All my sins were on fire, I threw out, I cried, I laughed, but I only wanted to scream. But once it starts, you cannot control the fire, right? I saw the beginning of time, it's lost. How it's spent, how time is owned, how I'm owned. I've switched the pain to pleasure, and it was a bad idea. Edward, I fully lost myself, only to find it again. Like a god, I invented myself only to find disgust, guilt. And after all, if you're scared to die, you aren't worthy of living. Have you found them? He witnessed his eyes, and you should not allow it. Or maybe, maybe he should. Everyone should. For the time being. Hi everybody, I am Guido Ponzini, and as a senior VFX tech artist and a Houdini FX artist, I worked with several studios as Ubisoft, Studio Gobo, Edi Effetti Digitali Italiani and Supernova Games Studios from 505 Group. I had the possibility to work both on offline and real-time VFX, even if in the last period my main focus is on real-time game engines. I worked on several AAA titles as well on, as cinematics, advertising and motion VFX. I teach Houdini FX and Unreal Engine at University Naba in Milano and in the free time I do short movies in Unreal Engine. My first short movie, Life is a Rally, and Faust, my second short movie, Faust for Virus, have been awarded with Motion Design Award of the Day, FWA of the Day, DDA of the Week and of the Month, and they were featured on the Epic Showcase and on the CG Brass Community. This course is packed to give a complete overview of the most common workflows for creating short movies and filmmaking in general, with Houdini and the Real Engine 5. So why you should uh, take this course? First, I would say you will learn the most used workflows to exchange data and assets from Houdini into real-time game engine. You will also learn workflows in order to organize your project in a real engine uh, with in your mind how to migrate content between users and how to easily reuse your uh, setup. You will have a complete overview and asset on asset production and integration between Houdini, Unreal Engine, Substance Painter and other software. And uh, the course is packed with tips and tricks that I learned from filmmaking processes and uh, they are aimed to give you a clean and focused path in order to have a sort of survival guide that can be addressed easily while you will make your own project. You will learn as well the basic techniques for producing high quality content into real-time engine cinematics. So I hope to see you in the course and thank you very much for listening.